Welcome back to Plant-Based Kidney Health, everyone. Michelle Krosmer and Dr. Hashmi here. And the question for today, Dr. Hashmi, is can people with kidney disease take creatine supplements? Are there any short or long-term benefits or negative consequences? Yeah, so this is a really interesting point because creatine, it turns out, is actually one of the most studied substances out there. And what we know about it is, is when it comes to looking at creatinine levels, if you end up taking creatine, what you want to know is, is if you immediately go, immediately meaning within 24 hours, go and get a blood test, you might see that your blood test levels of creatinine may be slightly elevated. Even though they're slightly elevated, that's not anything dangerous. It's not going to translate into anything long-term going on. So as far as that goes, creatine turns out to be very, very safe. Now, on the flip side, sometimes people are using creatine as part of a high protein diet. So you might have somebody younger who's lifting a lot of weights, also doing lots of protein, lots of creatine going on. So not only will you see a transitory rise in creatinine, which is how we measure the indirect way of measuring kidney function in the blood going on, but you'll also see that your blood urea nitrogen levels will be slightly higher. Now, once again, the BUN going up, that's because of higher amounts of protein going in. The creatinine going up is because you're taking more creatine. Remember, creatine will go into your muscles and convert to creatinine going on. We have lots of really good studies going on. There was one in the Journal of Renal Nutrition 2019. It's a meta-analysis, meaning they took all these different studies, put them together, they did both a qualitative and a quantitative analysis. It's just a fancy way of looking at it was a lot more specific than most studies. And what they concluded was that creatine supplementation does not damage the kidneys. Now, creatine has a number of uses for most people who are lifting, for example. It's nothing magical. So if you got you know, younger folks at home who are into bodybuilding or just getting fit and they think creatine may help you to get bigger, creatine holds on to water. So a lot of people will find that they have a little bit more water in their muscles going on. But specifically, when it comes to lifting, people find they may get one additional rep than they normally would if they're taking creatine. So the way the creatine builds muscle is it will allow you to get a little bit more of that resistance training than you would without it. And that's it. So if you want to take creatine, it's perfectly okay. Lots of data to talk about short-term and long-term safety there. All right. Thanks, Dr. Ashmi.